at how we can create a combined flow so that we can see both our DNS traffic and our HTTP traffic in a single screen. So what we do is we go to the Clear Site button and we come over here and click on Combined Flows. We then click on the New button to create a new combined flow. We give this flow a name. We'll call it Hilton because it's the Hilton website that we've collected traffic from. I then click on Hilton and this is because when I go to Add Flows it's going to say uh, add it to the selected flow and if I don't have a flow selected then we get an error message. I'll come back to detail and the first thing I'm going to do is click on this DNS lookup right here. I can then right click and say add selected com add to selected combined flow. I'm then going to select this DNS query and right click and add it to the selected combined flow. I'll then come over here to my HTTP traffic and I'm going to grab this first get and this is the original get that I send out to the Hilton website. I'm going to right click on that and I'm going to say add that to the selected combined flow. So now when I come over here to combine flows I can see that I've got my DNS queries going out to the web server or to the DNS server and here I've got my TCP SYN packet going out to Hilton.com. And I can also see in this particular trace that I send my HTTP GET. The server at Hilton comes back in 125 milliseconds, shows that it did receive that packet at a TCP layer, but it then takes another 4.85 seconds before it returns my web page to me. So this is how we can use the combined flow feature to take traffic from different flows and put it together into a single picture. And if we expand this, we'll see each one of the flows. And I can click on each flow individually, or I can click on, in this example, this URL, which it would attempt to bring up if uh, we could get to that site. Or I can click up here and look at the whole combined flow. So that's how we combine several flows of data into a single picture. And we can come in and export this and save it as a PDF file if we want to display and show somebody the entire combined flow.